Good morning, everyone. I'm uh, here at my Boondockers Welcome campsite. Wisconsin. It's a, a dog friendly, people friendly site, I guess you'd say. And uh, I'm not going to show you too much of it because I, I respect their privacy, but uh, it's right in town and it's less than uh, 10 minutes away from my appointment this morning. So I. Uh, picked it for convenience plus there's an off-leash area as you can see I can run Sophie around a little bit trees the blocked road noise a little noisy right now but it's morning uh, during the evening and it slept really well really quiet so another option you have when you're out uh, traveling is uh, boondockers welcome I can't say enough about the app I've used it seven or eight times this year uh, for $50 and quite the bargain when you figure out what campsites cost this, this, this time of year and there really was no free camping in this area besides maybe a truck stop or something and uh, if I can camp in a place like this I'd rather all right we'll catch up with you in the next stop well I'm gonna try to finish my latte before I go in so I don't have to wait in there too long. <laughs> uh, it's embarrassing not being able to fill the cup. show you the rig I'll be driving here and yes it is an automatic unfortunately but it's their truck and to work here that's what my choice is so but uh, let's see There's an extra bunk up here. Got a new mattress. It's a used truck, but it's only got 111,000 miles on it. Got satellite TV, uh, H, uh, Showtime, Cinemax, or HBO and Cinemax, and NFL Sunday Ticket, all included. Got windows back here. I can open up. This is Sophie's favorite sp spot to lay and watch the world go by. Here's the tea in the refrigerator here. Got a freezer there. I will have my microwave right in this compartment right here. And I'm not sure whether or not I'm going to put my CB in here or not, or leave that one in there. Here's the closet. Storage for your clothes. And this seat right here will spin around and, and face the back. Hey everyone. Well, I got uh, a lot of my stuff moved in. I got some grocery shopping done and got my internet hooked up in here and 
got some groceries put away and got the bed made with the mattress topper and Sophie's enjoying it as she cleans her paws but uh, I've got a little bit of a mess in the front here but I'll get that taken care of I got some boxes to take out to the trash but me and Sophie have been working with her new stairs and she's doing real good with them climbing in a little easier on her than trying to jump in and uh, I got the AC cranked up today it's a uh, kind of felt like Florida today real humid and hot and you can see I got the rig right out in front of me there I'm gonna get ready to put that up for the year I, I, I rented a storage unit today and uh, that's the way I chose. I mean, my whole life is in that motorhome, all my personal belongings and stuff, and it's, I'm not going to be around here to watch them. So if it gets broken into, it's not as big a deal if, uh, <laughs> you know, my stuff isn't in there. But uh, I did put a new deadbolt on it. It's not a real high crime area. There's, it's pretty, pretty, pretty safe here. I mean, there's cameras and stuff, and People he coming and going all the time here, so it's not a place someone wants to try to break into a driver's vehicle. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm. I guess my first load out will be Monday, and I'll take you with on that. Uh, I'd get a run back and forth between Wisconsin and Minnesota with uh, some parts, and uh, I'm going to be doing someone's dedicated run filling in for them while they're on vacation which is fine with me works great um i've got a little bit more moving i got uh i only get about a third of the stuff out of the out of the motorhome that i want to get out and i get the rest of that out uh get a few more things to set up in here a phone mount um uh, i've got to get my tablet which uh, is my e-log and how i do everything in there so I'll, I'll get that assigned to me and I'll get learn that um, if you have any questions on how I do this I plan to make some videos on how I do inspections and stuff and things I look for um, and uh, you know maybe going through a scale house what it's like in a truck or, or uh, shippers and receivers and you'll see kind of what I go through with that on a daily basis Plus, we're going to have some good sites along the way. You'll, you'll see how I choose uh, where I'm going to stop for the night with with uh, the number of hours I have to work and stuff. And I'll be running a tight schedule. I want, I'll be running two ways, uh, 303 to 306 miles one way. So I'll be putting in over 600 a day, which is pretty healthy miles. And I'll show you how... Uh, I plan all this and plan my stops and running run a tight schedule and trip planning and everything. I'm sure a lot of you maybe would like to know or, or haven't heard of how we do this, but uh, I'll go through how I do it. I was a uh, training driver for a few years for the company I work with and teach backing and stuff like that. Plan on possibly getting the drone up and show you how I set up for backing and uh, um, you know how how I hook hook up and disconnect from a trailer, little tips and tricks that I do, um, and just basically kind of take you with on my day, you know, and a typical day. So uh, yeah, it's uh. <laughs> I'm not ready to go back to work. I really enjoy my life on the road, but uh, hey, you got to do it to support to support my traveling habit, I guess. But uh, uh, I'd like to thank I've gotten over 30 new subscribers in the last few weeks. And I want to thank them for joining us and uh, watching the videos and all the subscribers that have stayed with me right right since I began this channel last November. Um, it's all because of all of you is where I'm at with my channel right now and uh, I hope to continue to grow and bring you good content and uh, 
And uh, if you noticed, I'm on a different camera today, a super wide lens. This is uh, GoPro Hero 9 with the Max lens on it. Um, I think I got my audio squared away too. Let me know what you think. Uh, I'm going to be using this camera more vlogging, uh, less than using the 8, but uh, the 8 has its uh, purpose too. I went ahead and ordered a new chest rig too, so I can get uh, good shots of when I'm fueling and doing different things on the road. You'll see how I do all that. So, uh, like I said, I welcome your comments, questions, anything you'd like to see, I'll try to put it out in a video. Thank all, I thank all you. You know, all are some of the best subscribers a guy could have. I mean, anybody on YouTube, I mean, you guys are very responsive, compliment me, give me constructive criticism, and I appreciate it. So, if you haven't already, remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you soon.